Schools will have class tomorrow. The district's decision to keep kids in class yesterday drew a lot of criticism from parents. Wait News reporter Michelle Alvarez is live on Marco Island. And Michelle, what did parents tell you? Lois, parents are still fuming over the fact that Collier Schools decided to have classes on Tuesday, expressing their concerns and saying that the county was under a tropical storm warning. And we also warned people on the Wink News Weather Authority about the possibility of a tornado. Now that warning proved to be true. And Chief Meteorologist Matt Devitt pinpointed the rotation on Doppler 3X and urgently asked everyone inside Tommy Barfield Elementary, teachers and students and staff to take cover. A tornado did come ashore on Marco Island, but thankfully not by the school. And afterwards, the district said if parents wanted to keep their kids home from school, they could. One mom I spoke with told me she would rather have Collier schools closed yesterday and open today. My son was scared, first off. He didn't know what was going on. And then when he finally got on the school bus, he was scared to drive home, you know, after hearing all the warnings and everything. And the, and the kids don't really understand, and the school did not inform them as far as, you know, the dangers and that they were safe, or at least tell them they're safe. Um, so my son was very worried yesterday, and he came home pretty stressed out for being 12 years old. Collier County Public Schools did tell me that 93% of students went to class on Tuesday. But another criticism we've heard are, are teachers in Collier County living in Lee County. Now Collier Schools did answer to us on that as well and said only 14% of their employees actually live in Lee County. We're now reporting live on Marco Island, Michelle Alvarez, Wink News. All right, thank you very much, Michelle. And talking about schools, Lee County schools will resume normal schedules tomorrow. Oasis Charter Schools in Cape Coral will also have class tomorrow. Charlotte County and DeSoto County going back to school again tomorrow. And again, of course, Collier is going to be open tomorrow as well.